Truck stolen at a local library crashes into an elderly woman's home. Clinton Police Department now searched for the driver after he fled the scene. News 10's Kate Green spoke with police and the woman's son. She joins us now live in the studio with more on the search. Kate? Patrice, Mark, this is the truck stolen from the Clinton Library during broad daylight. You can see the truck is a total loss after it crashed into this home on the corner of 7th and Ewing Streets. Police say it all happened around 2.30 this afternoon when they received a call from someone at the public library saying her truck had been stolen. The victim told police she left her car keys in the truck when she quickly ran inside. Shortly after, police found the truck here but did not find the driver. Only tire tracks and damage were left behind. It's usually not in broad daylight, not usually when people are out. It's usually more of a late night thing. But even in broad daylight, always lock your vehicle and check your surroundings. The home belongs to a 78-year-old woman who was not home at the time of the accident. We caught up with her son who came by to look at the damage. I'm surprised to see it all tore up after I just painted it a couple of weeks ago. You just hope the police can take care of the situation. Now he expects it will cost him thousands of dollars to fix his mother's home. Now police say witnesses described the suspect as a white male in his late teens, early 20s. He was last seen wearing blue jeans, a black sweatshirt, and a black cap with skulls on it. If you have any information regarding this incident, please call the Clinton Police Department. Mark, back to you. Thank you, Kate. The suspect could face charges of auto theft and criminal mischief. News 10 will continue to follow this investigation and bring you the latest.